Now we're going to take a look at the brand new live stream HD550 and HD51. Yeah, so, um, so these are the two devices. Um, so the first one is the 550, which is our portable version. Uh, when you purchase it, just like the HD edition, this is a 4K edition, it comes with a bag. So as a producer, you have your crew, your cameras, your audio setup, and this is all you need for your live video mixer. Uh, the bag comes with it, is included in the price, and then you open it, you have a handle, and you can pop it out uh, right there, and we've set it up already uh, for you. And on the side, you have the inputs and the connection, includes uh, a lot of USB, SATA input, you know, a lot of computer, there's a Windows computer inside, and then the video input. And then in addition, there's an HDMI input at the bottom that allows you to put a big monitor next to it. We haven't featured it here. Uh, so you can have a multi-screen and a producer or a customer can look at all the cameras on a bigger screen than you operate. Cool. So that's the Studio 550. Can we uh, take a look at those specs? Um, sure, and then the, the 51 just briefly, um, which, uh, well, let's do the 550 specs, perfect. Um, so the HD edition on the left um, has been basically significantly upgraded. So in the 4K edition, which we are launching today, we're now having a two terabyte SSD from a one terabyte SSD. I think we can have a big applause for that. <laughs> <laughs> um, the CPU is a i7, uh, which had six cores, and now we've switched to eight cores, which you'll see in the demo is actually uh, 16 virtual processor instead of uh, 12 virtual processor. And then we've also upgraded the GPU uh, for future proofing, and we've upgraded the RAM from 16 gigabyte to 64 gigabyte. Cool. So if we look now at the 51, um, so the 51 is our rack mount version, and it's also available in HD edition and 4K edition. Uh, and you'll see all the specs are exactly the same. So think about it as a uh, rack mount version or desktop version of the 550. It's slightly more affordable, but it has all the same input output. The only other exception is there's no XLR input. There's XLR audio input on the 550. And then it has two HDMI out because there's no built-in monitor. So you can have one monitor or two monitor, just like the 550, but using your own monitor instead of the built-in uh, one. So that's the 51 4K. Great. So I think we also have a shot of the inputs um, for these pieces of hardware. Do we have that slide? Great. So this is the back. And actually, it's exactly the same between the HD version and the 4K version. So you have five input, which are either SDI or HDMI. The SDI, as we mentioned before, is 6G SDI, which support 4K at 30 FPS. Um, and the HDMI also is a standard uh, 4K HDMI or HD. Um, you can also see the XLR input and the computers that are built in with USB port, SATA port, two gigabit Ethernet port uh, for connectivity and streaming uh, and so on.